How's it going guys? My name is Eric Van Wilderman and welcome to a game called Glitch Space. This game looks pretty cool. People have described it as similar to Portal, where we have to solve puzzles in rooms to continue. But instead of going through portals and whatnot, we actually have to hack the game. Inside the game, there's in-game mechanics where we hack certain parts of the level to make the level do certain things that we want to do. It seems really cool. It's in its alpha stages, so I guess it's like an early access game, but I figured I'd give it a shot. Apparently, it's not that long right now, but I want to give it a shot. And uh, before we begin, I'm not wearing a beanie because it is super hot in Korea right now. It's already getting hot, and I don't have AC yet here. I don't have AC, and I'm going to sweat buckets probably because with these lights I have on, holy crap, does it make me feel toasty. Did I just miss that? I think I just missed it. Yeah, I was too slow. I'm, I'm sorry, game. I was busy telling everyone how hot I was. Not in the narcissistic way, by the way. Um, okay. Um, th this sensitivity is really low. <laughs> I wonder if I can change that. Like, it literally takes me forever. <laughs> it literally takes forever to turn. No, it doesn't take forever, but it takes a while. Okay. Trippy aesthetic, too. Whoa, oh, that was loud. Holy shit. Okay, sensitivity. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Resume. Oh, that's so much better. Yes. Thank God for options. I love, you know, some games that are early access like this, they have next to no options and it drives me crazy. So I'm really happy this game has options. Holy shit. I didn't do it. Whatever, whatever you think I did, I didn't do it. Oh, you're giving me an item. This is probably like my hacking gun or something. Woo! This is the null canvas. You can add and connect nodes to the canvas to create programs that affect the red cuboids in the world. Nodes are selected from a pop-out menu. Left to click to continue. Oh my god, so I will be hacking. I don't know much about programming. Okay, move object down. So I click the canvas, select numbers, <laughs> select 10. Nodes can be connected in two ways, clicking and dragging the output of a node to the input of another, or by clicking and dragging the nodes together. If the connection has been made correctly, a line will appear. Okay. I'm gonna mess this up so bad. Nodes can only be connected if their outputs and inputs match. Different types have different shapes, numbers, or for example, output a triangle. Okay. Connect the nodes. Hiya! So I connected them. Click X to quit. Um, I am oh this X. I thought I meant X on the keyboard, but it said click. You can't really click your keyboard. Okay, so I hacked it. That's cool. I'm a hacker. Wow! I'm gonna get into all your emails. Yeah. Any red object may be manipulated. Okay. Um, so like, where are the objects though? Locked nodes can't be deleted. Um. I feel like, oh, I see, yeah, I click there, and then I got the numbers, but there's a one. Okay, is the one good? I guess I want a one. Is there anything else? I guess numbers are only triangles, though. Numbers are triangles, so this one right here, I can't do anything about that yet, can I? Okay, so is that is that good enough, then? Well, I guess I, I can jump on it, which makes sense, but I'm gonna have to make this go higher, aren't I, for something. Yeah, I see how this works. I'm gonna have to connect higher numbers to do, like, more with it. So if I click, um, what am I doing there? Just X, X out of here, not there. So if I click uh, a number like 20, or 10, let's go 10. Um, then it'll move it, like, a different distance than, like, another number, won't it? Um, okay, let's, let's cut that. Just cut. Okay, let's try 20. Hey, 20! Boom! Yeah, and 20 moves it further. Oh, that's cool! That is super duper cool! I dig it! I love it! I love it! Oh my god! It's like Portal, but I'm a hacker! Holy shit, that's what we needed in the Portal games. We needed someone to hack the portals. These are namespaces, they alter the available functions in your toolbox. So, oh... So it changes what I can do each room, I see. So I got a new function. Okay, what? What's going on? That noise was super loud. Cords connecting nodes together can be cut to break the program. Hover over the cord. Oh, I already got that. I already had to do that once. Okay, cut! Get out of here. Nodes can also be deleted entirely by right-clicking on them. Okay, yeah, good. I already did that before, too. Logic has been added to your toolbox. Good, I need logic. 
Um, so logic, I'm assuming, is this little thing right here. Oh, there's true or false! That's so cool! So I guess we want false, and we'll just take it away completely. Ho <laughs> ho! True or false? It is like programming! True or false? Binary! Oh my god, I took programming for one year, so I know a little bit about it. I was never really good at programming. Actually, I was pretty good at it, I just didn't apply myself. Cuts! I want you to be true. That's right. Object is solid. Okay, so that's good. We don't need that anymore. It's already solid. Oh, maybe we gotta put true, though, on it. I'm guessing we're gonna have to put true. Okay! We got a solid object, it's good. And, um, now let's get on top of it. And then we're gonna hack it while we're on top of it because I'm a genius! Let's just put 20, it'll go take us all the way. Um, did that take us all the way? It did! It certainly did. Oh! Whoa! Guys, this game is super cool. I mean, it is in early access now, so I don't know how long it is. But my goodness, I am having a lot of fun with it. I love puzzle games. Beware of data flow. Why? What does the data flow do? Tell me! Tutorial me, please! Oh, I see. We gotta make that- okay, hey. Get out of here, false shit. We need to make- no, no numbers, please. We need to make you true! That's right. You are true. Okay, so those would kill me, I guess. The data flow would kill me. And now you're changing what I can and cannot do again. Some nodes look a little different. They are called abstractions and contain multiple nodes, which create full functions. As you progress, these abstractions break apart, giving you more freedom. Okay. Vectors now been added to your toolbox. Be sure to use the widget in the bottom right to find out uh, which vector to use. Oh, jeez. Okay. Use the widget to determine the vectors. What? The... Yeah, I got it. Okay, widget, vectors, I got an angle. Um, do I want to... Let's move it along the y-axis. The y-axis. Okay, move. I don't think that did anything. Do I got it? What? What in the hell? Okay, guys, I'm so dumb. I'm, I, <laughs> I totally missed this. We got to connect a number uh, to how far we want to move it, right? Okay, cool. We got it. So um, now that I'm here, I wonder, I should just move it up, shouldn't I? Why don't I just change this to a Y? Yeah, you're going up. Oh, I'm stuck in there and you're going, there you go. Get out of my face. Ha! Ah, take that, cube! Get up there! I don't know why that took a couple minutes to figure out. I was like, huh, there's that weird triangle shape on the side of the vector. That was really dumb of me. Okay, so we want to move this up a tidbit. Not too much, though. Let's move it up, like, uh, five slots. Hey! Boom! Yeah, I'm amazing. I am so cool. And now I can move this over towards me. How am I gonna do that? X. Good, and 20 we can take out. Okay, we don't need that there. Okay. Oh yeah, we gotta put 20 back there. Okay. Take me over 20. Oh, that's so much fun! I'm hacking it and like, and it moves while I'm on it. <laughs> oh my god, this game is so much fun and you have to play it if you get the chance. No, I don't want you. We need to move you along the y-axis. That's right, move me up. You do as I say, block. Uh, 10? Yeah, 10's fine. Yeah, 10 is perfect! Yes! Next level onwards! <laughs> Oh my god, guys, if this is $13 on Steam right now, if you get the opportunity, please do yourself a favor and play this game. It is, it is, it totally reminds me of Portal, minus like the crazy story that Portal had. Holy crap! What the hell? Some cubes have pre-programmed functions that cannot be edited. Okay, so that cannot be edited. Um, 50 apply force upwards. <laughs> I like it how I can just, oh, I can't edit anything here. I thought I could at least edit a little bit. But you can't cut it or anything. Okay. Um, where am I going? I mean, can I really make it there? I guess I gotta move that down, don't I? Okay, it doesn't want to move down. I don't have any minus numbers. No, I don't have any minus numbers. What if I put zero? Zero. That does nothing. Oh, no. Oh, no. But hey, let's try that. It's really close to me. Hey. Oh, yeah, I can get there now. Okay. I'm high enough. Woohoo! I'm high. So fucking high. Okay. Let's move this bitch. Okay, X plus, let's just go 20 all the way. Oh my God, so cool, so cool. <laughs> I feel like a little kid again. I don't know, I love games that make me, oh geez. Well, 
at least we start right here. That's so nice of you, game. Thank you. Um, oh yeah, I can't change anything there. Is there anything over there? There's that! What are you doing, Kay? Um, one sec. I gotta get... I gotta get into position so I know what uh, the axes are. Okay, so the x-axis is to the left, I believe. X. Connect. Numbers. Ten? Is that right? Is that good enough? Ah, uh, that's gotta be good enough. Okay, all the way, baby! <laughs> that was enough. That was kind of sketchy. That was a little bit over to the right. I was a little bit scared. Okay, I'm gonna probably jump up with that, aren't I? Hey. You go up. Y-axis. And not that much. We only need it probably like five. Five sounds about right. No, we need more. Ten. Yeah, ten is good. Oh my god, I am a master hacker, guys. I should become a hacker. What am I doing being a YouTuber? I'm, I'm quitting my job. I'm quitting. Tool upgrade. Oh, I got another one! Hold shift and left to click. Oh my god, I can make a cuboid now! I can make one! The possibilities are endless! I wonder if I can make one and then, like, jump. No, if I'm on top of one, I can't make one, I don't think. I mean, that'd be kind of cheap if you could make one and then jump on top of it, like, while you're in air. I mean, it would take mad skills. Can I hack it, though? Oh my god, I can hack it. Okay, the plot thickens. Holy shit. Use the middle mouse wheel to change where you want to- Oh my god, this is so cool. Okay, let's just, um, let's put it right here. I can just jump on it now. I don't even have to hack that one. It's kind of cool that you can, like, put it into- Oh no! Oh, I walked forward. I got Silverzels. Hey, look where I am. <laughs> I found a new place! Can I get back? Oh my god, I can get back! I thought death was inevitable! I saved myself! I'm amazing! I know! I'm pretty good! There's no sprint button, by the way, so you just gotta- Just gotta do it. Oh, that's just a mirror, I see. I was like, what? There's something around behind there? Um... This game is so cool. Oh boy! This game wasn't already trippy already. Now we have moving objects. Hey! Holy shit. Look at this when you try to hack it. Look at that. Along Y vectors counter. And there's a counter now? Oh my god, we're gonna have a new function soon. Or whatever it's called. A new a new thingamabobber. Yep, here we go. New thingamabobber. Oh. Hey! Let's get off of there. Okay, so my cube is red and can also be manipulated. I, I gotcha. But how can it be manipulated when there's nothing to connect to, right? I got an abstraction. Object is solid. Move object. Oh, I can put a move object there. I see. That's that's like a function that I can just put there. I can now put move object there and I can connect it with numbers and vectors. Yes! Okay, let's just put you there. We got a move object right here. Okay. We're going to connect a vector to it. Move up, baby. Let's move up. And move up by 20. We need to go up by a lot. Yes, thank you. Thank you, object. You're the best. Oh, th was I supposed to go up here? It looks like I need to get to the top. Or just across. Never mind. Okay. Um. <laughs> please take me across. I need to go along. The Z axis pushes it forward, doesn't it? Z axis, push me. Push me, baby. Wow, yeah, I got it. Okay. Very neat. Can I jump there? Nope, I can't. I gotta manipulate the shit out of you. Oh, wow, out of bounds! Oh, no! Oh, but X minus, I don't have minus numbers yet. I literally don't have any minus numbers. I'm gonna have to take that one towards me. 90? Hey. Cut. Well, that's okay. Well, uh, <laughs> that was a bit of a simple solution that I kind of feel dumb for not getting. I should have just hacked that first. But I really wanted to hack my own object because my own object, it's like my own. It's like my baby. You're my baby object. I love you. What? Okay. Off we go. Mysterious. I wonder what are we doing? Are we inside a computer or something? Is this what happens when hackers hacks inside computers? 
from Hacker's Hack. Sometimes certain functions of the toolbox... Yeah, I know that. Am I... Did I get something else that's new? Because that's crazy if I did. That's a lot of new stuff I'll have been getting. Alright, let's just put you here, my baby. Hey, baby! Ah, you're blocked. Eat it. No one can stop my hacking prowess. I'm pretty amazing. Holy shit! I, it's, I thought I got something new in my toolbox. Oh, I got 90. So I got a huge ass number, 90. Holy crap. And is that uh, 20 or is that minus 20? No, 20 is gone, just 90. All right, so I got 90. What am I gonna use that for? Oh, maybe I, I, don't, I got it. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I can change that 90 degrees is what it means. Rotate object is a new tool. Oh my God. Rotate object. Oh, I gotta choose an axis first. All right, how is this gonna work? Y, Z, I gotta choose Z, I think. And no, oh, what a failure. This is getting complex, guys. X, shit. 90, there we go, that's good. But it's not blocking shit, oh no. All right, that should protect me, right? I'm protected. Okay, so I can rotate objects now, that's pretty cool. Um, should I be going in here? Nope, just take me up. Take me up, please. I keep on forgetting I gotta use the vectors now. Move object along the Y vector by a total of 10. Thank you. Off we go. Problem solved with Eric on the case. Whoa, that's kind of trippy up there. Now, Portal, like I said, Portal had like a point to it. There was a story behind what we were doing. We were in like Aperture Labs. I'm wondering, what is the purpose of this? Are we ever going to find out the purpose of this? Or is it just like puzzle solving for the sake of puzzle solving? Okay, let's rotate you. You are being rotated. And now I got to use my own uh, little platform to get across, right? I think that's how we got to do it. Block. And that's not rotate object. We need to move you. So we'll go move object. 90? Oh, okay. I gotta choose the vector, of course. So, uh, forward is what in this case? I think it's Z. Let's go with Z. If I die here... Ah! Where'd I go? I did it! Oh my god! I got across! Thanks, platform! <laughs> I thought I was dead. <gasps> oh, man. But it's usually only temporary. Yeah, um, our gun will change, so now we have less options, I guess. So I hope, like, it'll only give us the options we need to solve the puzzle. Well, I, you know, I, I hope it is, because I think there's going to be a lot of functions eventually, and it's going to get pretty damn complex. Okay. What the heck? Um, let's just get on top of you. Why? And how far do we want to move it? We want to move it. Let's try 20 first. I think 20. What? Hey, I was on top of you. I thought it would move me up with it. Hey, what a cheater. You cheating little scumbag. Whatever. I got my own platform. I don't even need you. I hacked the shit out of my platform. I don't even need you, platform. Well, I kind of do to get across, but I don't need you to push me up like an elevator. You failed at your job. Hope you feel bad about that. What? Oh, okay! Sometimes the cuboid you need might be a little tricky to get to. Where is the cuboid I need, though? Is the cuboid's down there? Ugh. Okay, so we're gonna rotate this. And I can get behind it now, which is great. Oh, shit! Now I need to move it. Is that right? I gotta move it. Which way? X plus. Okay, so let's get the X axis there. We're all connected. Numbers. 90 is a lot. Let's try 20 first. You can always come back to it. Oh! I'm scared. Okay, there we go. What, what do I need this for? I need to go up. Like, let's move it 90. Oh! I killed myself because <laughs> I got rid of it. 
when I shouldn't have. Oh no, that was bad. Okay. Oh, ow, that hurts too. Oh no, now my cubite went away. I'll oh, screw you. Okay, let's move that forward a little bit initially. There we go. 20, please. There we go. I got it. I think. I, oh, definitely, yes. Now this can come up. Hoorah, baby. Let's start with five. It'll move up. Okay. And now, hopefully it's a bouncy one. No, it's not a bouncy one, but we need to go up. So we're going to change that to 20. And that takes me up. My own one doesn't, like, move me with it, though. Oh, that's really cool. I've been saying that the whole time, but I really enjoy unique ideas like this in games. Because, I mean, it is hard to make a unique game these days, right? Because there's so many different kinds of games that have been done. I mean, it can still be done, but there's a lot of games that build off one another. And this game feels super fresh, and so I really like it! I... let's cut that. How did- uh, that's- that didn't work at all. So we need to move you along the Z-axis. Z-axis. And I want to move you 20, I think is okay. 20, good. Now, I wish we could rotate this. I think we can. Abstraction. Rotate. We, look at this hacking shit. We are hacking so much now. It is insane. Um, I think we need to hack... The z-axis with the rotation. I always- I'm not really sure about that. Yeah, it is the z-axis. Okay, I got it. And now we can go across. Boom! Boom! <laughs> and it just fits like a glove. How beautiful. Oh my. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna end the episode here. You can find this game on Steam. It just came out. It is, it's super fun to play. You guys have no idea. Um, remember to leave a like down below. If you want to see me finish this playthrough, I definitely will. I think I will anyways, though, to tell you the truth, because I'm having so much fun with it. And uh, I'll see you then. As always, guys, peace.